everybody, welcome back to another part of The Sims 3 Ambitions. Um, today we are aging up Miss Ariella into a toddler. I am so very excited. I cannot wait for her to be a little toddler. Um, yeah, I'm excited to see what she looks like in all of that jazz. I don't know why Dixie is awake. I'm guessing Spirit woke her up, so love that for her. Um, Dixie goes back to work tomorrow, which is really exciting. She is for sure going to get a promotion, which will complete her lifetime wish. I am getting Brandon up right now to go do this because we have been working on this same case for so long. Um, so yeah, he's going to go do that right now. I don't care that he smells like a butt cheek. Um, he's going to go do it. So Miss Dixie is going to take care of both the toddlers today. Paxton is still sleeping, Devin is still sleeping, um, Ariella's almost awake, so we'll go, actually, let's have you change your clothes first, and then we'll have you come take care of your baby girl, maybe, hello, play with her, give her a bottle, and also snuggle her, she doesn't need to use the bathroom yet, so we are good, and Mr. Sawyer needs um to be fed so we'll take care of that also and i don't know if i want to do it today or tomorrow i think we'll actually do it tomorrow since today is ariella's birthday i want to go and get the last tattoos that dixie needs <laughs> sorry that's my dog um if you heard that noise i want to go get the last tattoos that dixie needs so she can be fully tatted completely covered from head to toe in all the tattoos okay so let's put Ariella back in her crib and then we'll come take care of Sawyer. He needs, let's see, we'll snuggle him, change his diaper, change his outfit, and then we will also attack him with the claw. Oh, and I can't feed him, so that's awesome. Okay, girl, hurry up. You got another baby to take care of. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, thank you. And then we'll come over here and feed him in the high chair. Mr. Paxton, what do we want to do with you today? He wants to send a love letter to um, Noel, so we will go ahead and do that. We'll also send one to Starla, and I want to try and become romantically involved with Ira today, so we will go ahead. Oh my god, he finished the task! Ah, oh, I'm so excited. Um, okay. Finally, that was like the longest case ever. He has seven more to do, which I'm super excited about. Since he's already like out and about, I'm actually gonna send him to the police station to actually, hold on. We're gonna go eat really quickly. And then, no, I'll just send him home because he doesn't need to use the bathroom. So he'll eat, come home, get a new case, take care of his shower needs. And then he will go out and do another case. Um, I do want him home when we age Ariella up, but I think I'm going to do that just a little bit later. I kind of want to take care of everyone else today. So we're going to send some love letters and then we're going to try and get to know this girl and invite her over, hopefully get him like a third little mistress, I guess. Not mistress because he's not married, but you know what I mean. Um, Devin, I'm going to go ahead and get you up and have you spend some time with Dexter. Dexter is supposed to be your dog and you barely interact with any dogs at all. So, um, yeah, we're going to come just kind of talk to the dog. They both need social anyway, so it's kind of a good thing. I will let Paxson sleep until 10 and then I'm going to make him get up. Okay, you go ahead and get up. You are taking care of Sawyer. Good, good. You're going to come home, use the bathroom. This whole house needs to be cleaned. Oh my goodness. It's fine. It's fine. We'll do it later. And then search for an investigator case. I know you can wait for someone to like... Oh, ask about food issue to three sims. Well, there you go. You can actually get a case. This is for his job, right? Yeah. You can get a case that way, so that's actually perfect. Instead of going home, we're gonna see if there's people here, and we're just gonna ask them about the food issue. I know he smells like a butthole, but we're just gonna ignore that for now. Game, what are you doing? Okay, thank you. 
This is such a cute little diner. Ariella, of course you had to wait until we walked away to do that. Is there nobody out here? Usually there's people out here. Probably because it's winter. Can we take this? <laughs> I wish we could just steal the laptop. Okay, there's literally nobody here. I'm kind of, oh, here's a person. Here's a person. Hello. Is this not a person? Is this not a person? I can't even, okay, irritating. Can't even talk to you. Um, let's see, is there like a community lot right here? Yeah, let's go to the swim center in the middle of winter. Makes total freaking sense. Okay, here's actually three people right here. So let's ask about food issue. Oh my God, there's Starla. Um, yeah, of course we'll talk to her. So here's the girl that Paxton has like started kind of talking to, talking to some other boy. But honestly, are we surprised because Paxton has a bunch of other people too, so. Why did you feed him on the floor? I hate them. Did you at least get your bottle? Um, Ariella was not invited to a party, I promise you that. We're pro I'll say we're going, but we're probably not gonna go. Okay, did you get your bottle? Okay, good. Go eat. And then you can take care of your baby. No, oh my God, Devin, no. You're killing me here. Okay, Devin, you need to come and discover potions. You need to become level eight before you move out. And when do you move out? In four days. So you need to like work really effing hard. Okay, so he's gonna chat with Noelia, or not Noelia, um, Noel. And I think we're actually gonna come out here and work on the car engine a little bit. That's something I would like to get done today. So let's go back and focus on Brandon. I do want him to be home before, you know, we age Ariella into a toddler, but I really, really, really want to focus hard on his career, so it's kind of like a, a catch-22, I guess. But he will need to come home and shower, so after we do this, as long as the next thing isn't like something we can do in like a second, we will go home and take care of that. Yeah, I've had some issues with food poisoning lately. I probably won't be shopping there anymore. I feel like we've done this exact case already, but, you know, it is what it is. She's like, hey, I'm definitely not dating your son and this guy at the same time. Don't worry about it. A good friend of mine became quite ill after eating at the beach shore the other day. Something isn't right in the kitchen. And we got our weekly stipend of 1840 for Dixie and 2475 for Brandon. So he needs to go eat, but he's not hungry, so we're going to send him home um, until he gets hungry. And once he gets home, we will be able to um, age Ariella up into a toddler, which will be good for her. Go ahead and take a shower. And Paxton, where's your imaginary friend? Go ahead and play with Lucky. We are not going to your party, I'm sorry. And you need to come get your little baby. Your, hello, your little bean. And I hate putting my babies on the floor, but we're just gonna set her down, down here. I don't know, um, who does she know best? She knows her mom best, what a shock. Mm. Yeah. And then we'll just kind of wait until Brandon is out of the shower. And then we'll go ahead and age up Ariella. Devin is working on his logic. Paxton is working on his car. Sawyer is just playing with his imaginary friend. We love to see it. Um, I think I'm going to kind of give up on having puppies. Since they are considered litter mates, they're not able to try for puppies together. And honestly, like, as much as I would love puppies, this isn't a pet cell piece, so it's not something that's really important to do. So I'm not too worried about it. Why don't you go eat since your hunger's low and then use the bathroom? Oh, Ira. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ira and Starla are in a relationship? Oh, wait a second. 
it. Ira. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. The tea. The freaking tea. Okay, I guess we'll just keep snuggling and playing with her. Oh, we still need to teach Paxton to drive also, so I think that is something we will focus on. Boy, what are you doing? Work on the engine. I think teaching him to drive is something we will focus on probably in the next part. Um, like I said, I really want to age her up and focus on teaching her her skills. And then I really want to focus on Brandon finishing this case. So, yeah. Okay, he's basically out of the shower, so I'm gonna go ahead and buy the cake, age her up, everyone's gonna come to her birthday. I was considering, sorry, my dog is so loud. I, it's his nails on the hardwood floor. I trimmed them, but they're super long, and like I'm scared to go too short because I don't wanna hurt him, but like they're really long, I should probably trim them again. But like I said, I'm scared. Um, anyways, I was gonna have a, birthday party for her but honestly this house is just too cramped <laughs> like it's too cramped I think once um Devin moves out instead of turning his room into an office I'm just gonna take the walls down and expand and make that like the living room because it's just it's just too cramped it's way too cramped in this house so that'll give us a lot more space Oh yeah, for a second I was like, Sawyer, why aren't you coming? But he's a toddler. Um, I am just going to really quickly teleport him upstairs. Just because I would have had Dixie put him down upstairs, but she didn't even freaking put him in the high chair like I wanted her to. So that's frustrating. Okay, we need to work on cleaning up this house. So that is what Dixie's going to focus on for probably the rest of the day. All right, Ariella, what hair, hair color do you have? That's what I'm most curious. All the kids always get the same hair color and I really want something different. So she's now a toddler. Oh, she got something different. Thank God, that was like perfect timing. It is just like basic brown, but she doesn't have like the freaking super red hair like her mom like don't get me wrong i love that color but every child does not get the same hair color you know what i mean oh my god i love her i love her she probably takes after her dad the most with the dark skin tone or like darker let's see i think she has hazel eyes which i don't know who she got that from because i'm pretty sure brandon has purple and dixie has blue Okay, I just had to like triple check that Brandon was her father. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, I just had to triple check that because she looked so much not like her siblings. I was like, wait a second. Oh, wait a second. Okay, you're not going to grab a slice. You're actually going to go to the bistro. I know you're not really hungry, but I, I just want to get it done today. So that's what we're going to do. Um, Devin, I will allow you to grab a slice. Paxton, you can grab a slice also. Dixie, you are not really hungry, so don't grab a slice. But we can go ahead and feed Ariella. So, stop moving. We're going to come over here and snuggle her, attack her with the claw, and then feed her in the high chair. And I'm just gonna help them out a tiny bit and put the cake away for them. Man, I was hoping they would sit together so they would talk a little bit. Rude. Okay, so he is going off. Paxton is fine. Ariella is fine. And why don't you actually, I know you like literally don't have friends, but just chat with someone random to get your social up a little bit. And then you, mister, we're gonna keep chatting with Ira and try and invite her over. I thought I told him to invite her over before and I never got like the yes I'm coming or no I'm not. So I don't know if she actually, if he actually did or not, but let's give it a try. 
All right, we'll go ahead and fill both these dog bowls. <clears throat> and let's see here. So today's just kind of casual, cleaning the house, relaxing, you know, aging up our little baby. Our youngest is a toddler. That's kind of like really sad. But also, we're pretty close to being elders. Okay, so she is back to not aging um, because her, actually, she's back to her proper age. Oh my God, this is so frustrating. So freaking frustrating. So if you guys remember, Dixie was supposed to be like four to five days younger than Brandon, and then the aging got messed up, and she was actually a day older than him, and now it looks like she's back to what she should be. He is 16 days, and she's 21 days, so that puts her at the proper like five, five days younger than him that she's supposed to be. So I'm not going to age her up early or anything, but... Yeah, just just throwing that out there. Okay, your social got up pretty good. Let's see if she says yes to coming over. Sure, I'll come over in a little while. Okay, perfect. She is on her way. All right, let's go ahead and toss Ariella in the air and we will potty train her upstairs. Let's see, Sawyer. Okay, I definitely told you to play with the other one, but that's that's fine. Either one is fine. Okay. So then we will come over here, potty train Ariella, discuss food supplier with Sugar Free. I don't know who Sugar Free is, but go for it. We have, oh bitch, uh-uh, I got four kids, leave me alone. And then I'm gonna let her take a nap. Actually use the bathroom first. But I'm going to let her take a nap because she has had a very long, busy day. Most of it has been by herself. Like, she does have two teenagers to help, which they don't really help because um, they're teenage boys. But she does have two teenagers if she really needs the help that bad. But I really want to focus on getting Brandon's career, like, taken off and, you know, completed. Because that's kind of the whole point of this is to complete the Let's Plays not the let's play complete the um what am i trying to say here complete the careers there we go you make sure he's still are you gonna hello like why are you not moving go go f and get her oh my god he could have done it through his phone the entire time um, Ira is still not here, so let me just see. Did either of them have handiness? I think she does. Yeah, she has handiness, so she will repair that shower for you, Paxton. So rude of you to break. Um, I guess we'll come out here and just continue working on the car engine since she decided not to show up. How rude of her. Girl, I know you're tired. Just, just give me a minute. What happened? What happened? So confused. Um, okay, he needs to inspect the mail. The mail of what? Oh, this person's house. Okay. Do, 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 do. I did install a mod into my game. I have to make sure I installed it properly because it literally has not helped at all. Um, it's supposed to eliminate lag. Um, not like completely, but it's supposed to help your game run smoother. And either it is a lie and does not work at all, or I just did not install it properly. So I will have to figure out which one of those it is. I'm gonna see, maybe they can't get to the xylophone over here because I swear every time I tell Sawyer to play with the xylophone, he doesn't. So can they even get to it? Yeah, she got to it just fine, okay. I will add a few more things to Ariella's room in the future, uh, probably before the next part. Um, but for now, she can just use Paxton's toys. It's not a big deal. Okay, he is inspecting for clues. You are still doing this. Good, good. You, my friend. Well, your friend never showed up, so... I guess you can just go work on your car. Did he just blow up? He did. Love to see it. 
Um, he's gonna have to come upstairs and use his mom's shower because, oh, look at that freaking toilet. Oh my god. Disgusting. Freaking disgusting. He's gonna have to use his mom's shower because his is broken. Oh my god, Spirit just got fleas. This is too much. <laughs> this is too much for me. I haven't had a big family like this in so long. I've actually learned that like I handle smaller families better. So I typically do like three kids and one pet or like two kids and two pets. Um, and right now I have four kids and two pets. So I'm a little bit stressed. I actually think I'm gonna go ahead and end this part here. I know it's kind of a weird time because it's like in the middle of the day, not middle of the day, it's like 8 p.m., but I'm gonna end this part here. Basically, I'm just gonna take care of babies and clean the house, so it's not super exciting stuff anyways. Brandon is gonna keep working on his, um, uh, what is this called, on his case. I doubt he'll solve it, but if he does, you know, he's still got six to go before he gets his promotion, so it's not like you're missing out on anything. But what I think I'm going to do, I'm going to play tomorrow on camera. Like, I'm going to film tomorrow, Monday, because Dixie, one day, in no, bitch, why does she keep, I'm going to force her to go to work. Like, I don't know why it keeps forcing her to take longer. It was literally one day in 10 hours this morning, and now she doesn't go back till Tuesday? Uh-uh. I'm forcing her to go to work tomorrow. Um... Um, what was I going to say? She will be getting her promotion, which will complete her lifetime, which, which is really exciting. And then Devin, he will be aging up on Wednesday and then graduating and moving out of the house on Thursday. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to film him aging up on Wednesday and then I'm going to skip and film Thursday as a family. So I will play Tuesday off camera and then most of the day Wednesday off camera. And then from there, I'll probably skip until Brandon only has one case left um and then that'll probably be the last part so there's only like three possibly four more parts left of this lp after this kind of sad because i love this family but it is kind of getting redundant and repetitive and it needs to come to an end at some point um i think someone suggested or maybe i made this up in my head i honestly can't remember doing like an ambitions 2.0 with their kids and having their kids um, do like different careers because ambitions actually comes with a lot of careers. I think that is a great idea. Um, it will be far in the future, but most likely I will take like Sawyer and Ariella because they are the closest in age and I'll have each of them do a different um, career path. So if you're interested in that, let me know. Like I said, it will be a ways in the future because I do already know, um, even once this comes to an end, I still have like four to five other Let's Plays going. So I don't want to start another Let's Play. Like I don't, I currently have six. Like I have six Let's Plays right now. My um, Medieval only has one part and then it's done. And then this has, like I said, three to four more parts and then it's done. So I don't want to ever have six again because that's way too much. So I won't do it for probably like a couple months, but I will definitely do that if you guys are interested. So let me know in the comments down below. I do apologize for this part. It felt very weird. Maybe it was just me, but it felt very weird, very not authentic. So I do apologize, but the next couple of parts will be really, really exciting stuff. So thank you guys so very much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, let me know by giving it a thumbs up, commenting down below, subscribing, all of that fun stuff. And I will see your lovely, lovely faces in my next video. Bye, guys.